What's up friends? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. This is EJ Joyful Plans and today we are going through a little haul from Jojo's Pretty Paper Shop and I'm really excited to look through these things. I haven't opened them yet, so we're gonna do this together. But this is, well, not this. Well, I'll tell you about that in a second. Um, this is, well, and I'll tell you about that in a second too. <laughs> these are sets from JoJo's May 13th, Friday, May 13th release. 12 o'clock Central Time. I'm actually posting this on Friday, May 13th. So as of the posting of this video, these are live on JoJo's Etsy shop. And I've showed JoJo stuff before. She's actually a good friend of mine. We met on Instagram over uh, our love of planners and we've been chatting in our DMs. I finally got to meet her at Go Wild and she's just a lovely person. And so um, she occasionally sends me uh, stuff from her new releases so that I can play with them and I can show them to you guys. And I'm happy to show off her stuff. She's one of those small shops where all of the illustrations that she does um, our hand-drawn illustrations. She does them herself. She makes her own sticker books and she quit her full-time job to do this. So anything I can do to support her, I'm like all about. So um, we're going to go through these. Let me first, let me just show you this first. This is not part of her release. This was something that she sent me just as a sweet, thoughtful gift, I guess. And this is, I think it's the, um, it's like a, journal of a uh, baby girl like things that she says things that happens and I have not been able to find this this is a couple years old but somehow she was able to find it it is so adorable so um, I thought that I would show this to you guys first before we get into the May release um, just so that you could see if you're having a baby girl or you have a daughter and you're able to find this this could be really awesome I haven't actually flipped through this yet but I just, I don't know. I just thought it was so sweet that Jojo sent me something for my girl. I just, it just means, I don't know, the world to me. And I've looked for some of the baby girl stuff that came out a couple years ago along with their pregnancy stuff. It can be a little tricky to find. So like seeing this in the, in the package from Jojo, I was like, are you kidding? Like, so sweet. So this is the mini size, beautiful plastic. Um, discs and it says out of the mouth of babes and it's just open oh, I love this texture this is just open journaling space with a date so something that she said or something that happened in our life together like you can lo log that and it's just like journaling and that's just repeated a whole bunch let's see if it's repeated through this whole this whole first section it's just the things that she says the things that are happening I just love that. It's so simple. I love that it's small so you can just throw it in your purse or I can throw it in my purse and I love the illustrations. Uh, and you can always like mix and match the pages, right? So this might have a different set of sheets in each section. There are three sections, but I can collate them according to whatever's going on and put them in alphabetical or excuse me, chronological order. Um, but here are like little quote bubbles, the dates and the stuff that she said and then another journaling section. This is repeated in that second section. I love that. Here's the third section. And then we have two larger quote bubbles with the dates. And then on the opposite side, a big journaling section with the date. So, so cute. It's like a happy notes meets like a journal, meets a memory keeper all in one. And it's just freaking adorable. So anyways, I just wanted to show that off. Um, oh, I just think this is adorable. She says the cutest things and other cute stories. So happy to have this. Thank you, Jojo, if you're watching this. That was incredibly thoughtful. Now let's get into the stickers, y'all. Okay, actually, no, <laughs> let's start with the notepad. The notepad is not new to the May release, but I don't have one and she sent me one. And I'm so glad that she did because when I look at the notepads on her or in her Etsy shop, uh oh, this whole thing's coming off. Um, I thought that they were the size of post-it notes. And I'm sure in the description it says what the dimensions are, so it just so you can get the whole impact. It looked like that. 50 sheets, and she made these herself. I presumed it was a three by three and didn't look at the description. I'm like, well, I don't need more sticky notes. I don't need little tiny notepads. This size, should I measure it? 
Do I have, let me see if I have a ruler nearby. Of course, I don't have a, oh yes I do. What are we talking about? So this is five and a half. It's five and a half by five and a half. So if I paid a little bit more attention to her Etsy shop, I would have noticed that this is not the size of a post-it note. But this is so beautiful. These are her illustrations of like the lavender flowers and the little bees. And they're just like, it's darling, darling. And I just love the size of it for my desk. So cute. So actually let's write information about the collections we're about to look at and then we'll get into it. So all of this stuff is coming out Friday, May 13th at 12 p.m. Central Time. And ooh, okay, so I know in here we've got the storybook collection and it is Jack and the Beanstalk. And then we've got Feathered Wing, ooh. Now I don't know if she gave me all of these, but I'm just writing these out for you to see. So Feathered Wings, and that's a two-piecer, two-piece mini set. Then we have Enchanted Garden, Enchanted Garden. That is a four sheet mini set. So by mini set, it means in your order you get the full collection. And then there's Rainstorm. Ooh, that's the one she's been working on with the petals, or not petals, puddles. <laughs> um, puddles and raindrops and stuff. And that is an eight piece collection. I think when they get big like that, you can buy the complete collection or you can, um, buy them individually. So we're gonna just set this over here so you can see it. And let's open Jack and the Beanstalk first. So here is the packaging, really cute. I think she even folds her own envelopes. It's closed with the washi. Um, it says, once upon a time, a boy named Jack lived with his mother on a poor English farm. One day Jack's mother sent him to the market to sell their beloved family cow, dot, dot, dot. Storybook collection number two, Jack and the Beanstalk. Everything that she does is so thoughtful. I connected with her at Go Wild when she was putting together like table mate gifts. And she was like hand folding like these custom little boxes with little sticker samples in it. And I was like, how do you do this? She's so creative. So if you buy the Jack and the Beanstalk collection, you get this gorgeous kind of opening page, which you could cut and put in your planner if you wanted to tell the full story in your, in your layout. And then look at this, how freaking adorable. All right, let's see what we got. Get this stuff out of the way. So here is a little thank you for buying the collection and this thank you card has stickers. So these flowers are stickers and even this little um, logo of hers is a sticker. So if you wanted to like put it down in the corner to remember where the stickers came from, that's a really great idea. Thank you for ordering from my small shop. As a special thank you for your purchase, I wanted to include this freebie in your happy mail. I appreciate your support of my shop and hope this the items bring you joy. So this freebie is having those cute little florals. And I love her storybook stuff. I love her scenes because it just, like my favorite thing in planners is creating like, yeah, a whole scene. And she does a lot of different types of like villages and uh, so cute. So we have this beautiful illustration here that she's done of the village and the lamppost and the flowers. So pretty. Here we have some more of the village and the flowers. So you can easily do a couple spreads that are just like green and whimsical and her kind of whimsy and joy tagline is like perfect because I feel like when you look at her illustrations they are definitely that like they have whimsy and they bring joy so there's the next sheet you get some functional boxes that are decorative and some added I don't know if those are daffodils or tulips <gasps> cute look at the little farm animals believe in magic so cute 
And then we've got some of the farm. Hold on, I think I need to... Hold on, guys. I don't want to lose you. Let me plug in my phone just to make sure we don't get disconnected here as I'm trying to film this. Okay. We've got our vegetables. And she drew these. How adorable. Fee fi fo fum. So you've got the bean stock. And then what you can so easily do, and what I'll probably do is attach these two stickers together so it goes up further on the page and there are the beans and there he is with his beans oh so cute golden goose oh, i love these illustrations oh and then look you can go all the way up to the clouds Oh, that is so cute. That is the Jack and the Beanstalk collection, storybook collection. So adorable. And she drew all those. I just love, I love the story that, that she's telling. So cute. Okay. Now, let's see what's in here. If we're going to see any feathered wings or an enchanted garden or a rainstorm, I'm not sure. Uh, so when you order from Jojo's Pretty Paper Shop, she puts all of her stuff in wedding envelopes, which I've said this a million times. It is so nice because you can reuse these and she doesn't seal it so that, yeah, you can reuse, reuse them. And also it's a heavier envelope. And so you know that the stickers are protected. I have never in the ones that the, the orders that I've placed with her and the ones that she has sent me, I've never had issues with her stickers ever. And I think it's because she packages everything so well and so thoughtfully. So this is the next envelope. And here is your freebie. Cute little galoshes. I love those little stickers. So cute. Love little bonuses like that. And let's see what we have. Oh, yes. I was kind of hoping she'd send me the rainstorm. Um, I definitely would have purchased these for sure. But check this out so these are so all of the jack and the beanstalk stickers are paper these are so far clear and we've got this girl in a beautiful like emerald green dress and she is looking out towards the rain with the yellow galoshes so cute and these raindrops are gonna look so good on a spread here's the next one also on that transparent sticker paper here she is with the galoshes splashing through the puddles. They're just so pretty. Life isn't about waiting for the storm to pass. It's learning to dance in the rain, Vivian Green. I just love these illustrations. Still on the transparent sticker, really vivid umbrellas. So beautiful. When life gives you a rainy day, play in the puddles got a bunch more drops and another puddle down at the bottom. I love that because collectively, if you get the whole collection, you'll have plenty of drops to go across your spread. And I love little details like that. So I like that there's a lot of drops and she uses all the space on the sticker paper so that you get like a good amount of stickers on each sheet. If it rains on your parade, dance in it. And look at this like silhouette of a girl with her umbrella. That's so cute. Let me get some rainy clouds up here, more drops in a big puddle. Without rain, nothing grows. Learn to embrace the storms of your life. We've got a really beautiful like tulip with like raindrops, dew drops on it. I love that. And finally, when it rains, look for rainbows. When it's dark, look for stars. Look at this sticker. That is gorgeous. That is really beautiful. I love that she's kind of holding onto the umbrella and it's like pushing away the storm. And then there's the rain rainbow in the distance. Beautiful, beautiful. So this is the Rainstorm Collection. So what I don't have here to show you, but I want you to definitely check out on her Etsy shop is the Feathered Wings Collection. It's two pieces and they're beautiful birds. 
And then the Enchanted Garden, which is beautiful flowers. I think there are some June bugs, like lightning bugs in it as well. So that is everything I received from JoJo from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop. I hope that you check her shop out. Um, I don't get compensated for... <laughs> for um, showing her stuff. So if you shop, I, I don't have an affiliate link or anything like that, but definitely let her know that I sent you, tell her I said hello, and that I just think she's a wonderful person. So uh, if you have any questions, leave them down below and come hang out with me over on Instagram. My handle is ejjoyful underscore plans. It is always a good time. If you wanna hang out with me again, I hope that you will subscribe to my channel. And until next time, friend, God bless you and keep you. Do something creative today and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.